In part 2 of this tutorial, you will learn more about the spatial search tools. Open the search widget. You are going to find the colleges and universities within the city of Payson. Open the text search tab. Click on the down arrow and select places. Enter Payson, all in uppercase, as shown in the example. Press search. Click on the result to zoom to the city of Payson. The city of Payson is highlighted in red. Open the spatial search tab. Click on the down arrow and select colleges and universities. Click on the entirely contained in tool. One result is found. This is the Hilla Community College. Next, you will locate the fire departments within two miles of this college. Open the spatial search tab. Enter a search distance of two miles. Click on the apply buffer tool. Click on the down arrow and select fire department. Click on the entirely contained in tool. Two fire departments are found. Next, you will draw a one mile buffer around these fire departments and locate the schools that fall within this zone. Open the spatial search tab. Enter a search distance of one mile. Click on the apply buffer tool. You can select the buffer color and adjust the buffer transparency. Click to open the select buffer color tool. Select a color. Drag the transparency slider all the way to the right. Click on the apply buffer tool. The buffers are fully opaque. Drag the transparency slider to the left till it reads 20%. Click on the apply buffer tool. Click on the down arrow and select schools. Click on the entirely contained in tool. There are six schools within these buffers. Click on the show results in grid button. You can see the types of broadband service and their speeds in the table. Close this window. Press clear. Open the bookmarks widget. Select Central Phoenix. Open the map display choices widget. Turn on the census tracts layer. Open the graphical search tab. Click on the down arrow and select census tracts. Enable multi-part graphics. Activate the select by point tool. Click to add a point to census tract 114200. Click to add a point to census tract 113202. Press search. Open the spatial search tab. Enter a search distance of 100 feet. Select green as your buffer color. Adjust your buffer transparency to 40%. Click on the Apply Buffer tool. Click on the down arrow and select Census Blocks. You are going to find how these three selection tools differ. Click on the Entirely Contained in Tool. This returns only the Census Blocks that are entirely contained in their green buffers. Open the Spatial Search tab. Click on the Intersected by tool. This returns all census blocks that are intersected by the green buffers. It is more than the previous case. Open the Spatial Search tab. Click on the Intersected by Envelope of tool. Imagine a rectangle that fits their green buffers. This is your envelope. There are 347 census blocks intersected by this envelope. The number is larger than the previous case. You can use the chart widget to find the total population within these census blocks. Open the chart widget. 
click on the down arrow, and select Senses Blocks. Activate the Draw Rectangle tool. Draw a rectangle to envelope the green buffers. There are 13,672 people within these 347 census blocks. The median age is 17. There are 6,732 households. Close the chart widget. Press clear. Next, you will locate all the schools within Maricopa County. Open the text search tab. Click on the down arrow and select counties. Enter Maricopa, all in uppercase, as shown in the example. Press search. Press the zoom button. Open the spatial search tab. Click on the down arrow and select schools. Click on the entirely contained in tool. Be patient. 819 schools are found that lie entirely within Maricopa County. Click on the Show Results in Grid button. Sort the Download Speed Tier column. In general, the schools showing an advertised download speed of 100 megabits per second and above have a fiber connection. Open the Spatial Search tab. Click on the third tool that says intersected by envelope of be patient this time 904 schools are found they fall within the rectangle that envelopes maricopa county open the spatial search tab click on the down arrow and select places click on the intersected by tool there are 48 census designated places that intersect Maricopa County. Sort the population column in descending order. The city of Phoenix has the highest population, followed by Mesa and Chandler. You are going to find the number of libraries in Phoenix. Open the graphical search tab. Click on the down arrow and select places. Activate the select by point tool. Add a point to select Phoenix. Press search. Open the spatial search tab. Click on the down arrow and select libraries. Click on the entirely contained in tool. Be patient. There are 20 libraries in Phoenix, the largest city in Maricopa County, with over 1.4 million people. Proceed to part 3. To learn more about spatial searches,